good morning my dear students i hope you all are fine so in the previous classes we already covered paint tool in computer so today we will start an another important application of computer that is ms word or microsoft word as we use a notebook to write words sentences or anything similarly in a computer we use word to type the text in a document now first we will start what is ms word or what is microsoft word so ms word or microsoft word is a word processing software it is made by the computer company microsoft its purpose is to allow users to type edit and save the documents next is what can we do with ms word or what are the uses of word application in computer so first is we can type and format the text in the word document we can edit text such as adding deleting copying and moving we can also add pictures in a word document or you can also save a document for your future use next we will learn how to open ms word in a computer system so first we click on the start button then select all programs then click on the microsoft office and then click on the microsoft office word after then word program will appear on your screen now we will learn different components of ms word or microsoft word first we start with title bar the title bar is placed at the top of the word window it display the document name followed by the programmer name second is quick access toolbar it is placed at the top left of the word window it contains the save option undo and redo command third is the ribbon the ribbon contains several tabs on it such as home tab insert page layout each tab has commands that are arranged into groups now group contains font paragraph and styles option these are used for formatting the text next is office menu or file tab the file tab and office menu is placed at the upper left corner of the word window we can create open save and print a file by selecting the file tab or office menu next is the ruler the horizontal ruler is placed at the top of the document window it measures the width of the document page and 
the vertical ruler measures the height of the working area. It is located to the left of the document window. Next is working area. This area is used for typing and editing the text. Then there is a scroll bar. There are two scroll bars in the word window, the vertical scroll bar and the horizontal scroll bar. The horizontal scroll bar moves the screen display toward right or left and the vertical scroll bar is used to move the document window up and down. Last is zoom slider. It is present at the extreme right corner of the status bar. You can drag the zoom slider toward right or left to enlarge or reduce the size of the word document. So these are the definitions of these components. Next we will learn how to create a new document in a word program. So first we click on the Microsoft Office button or File tab. Then select New option. Then select Blank document under the Blank and Recent section. It will be highlighted by default. Now click on the Create option. After then a new black document appears in the word window. So you can also create a new document by using the shortcut key control plus N. Or we can say that to open a new document in word program, the shortcut for this is control plus N. Now I will show you how to create a new document in Word program. So first we click on the office menu or file tab. Click on the new option. Then select blank document under the blank and recent section. Now click on the create option. Now the new blank document is appear in the word window. So, next we will learn how to save a document in a computer. So, first we click on the save button on the quick access bar or we can click on the file tab and then select the save option. Then type any name for your file in the file name box right here and then click on the save button. So the shortcut key to save a document is control plus S. The shortcut key to save a document is control plus S. So now you can able to understand what is Microsoft Word program. What can we do with the Microsoft Word program? How to open Word in a computer? What are the different components of Word program? How to create a new document in Word program? And how to save a document in Word. So, we will meet again in the next class to learn how to enter the text in the Word document. This is the worksheet related to this chapter. Part A is true and false. Part B is fill in the blank. And part 
see is answer the following question. So kindly do this worksheet on your computer practical file in handwritten form.